We would like to remind you that Species 7 is made possible in part by the following sponsors and grants. The Evelyn Woodberg Foundation for Really Ungifted Children. We've been helping graduate idiots since 1959. The Ted and Tina Grant for Wayward Swine and Helpless Hogs. Reminding you, eat more hamburgers. After all, they're not really made of ham. A generous donation by the National Film Board of Canada. Hey, my brother and I made a movie. Ah, oh, take off, you hoser. We did not, eh? And of course, generous donations by our Patreon sponsors, loyal subscribers, and viewers just like you. Thank you. Well, hey, folks, Species 7 here. Welcome back to the channel, and welcome back to Farm Sim 17 here on Watts Farm. So I've spent, uh, well, pretty much the entirety of the day cutting trees to try and make us some money so we can move along with uh, possibly a wee mowing expedition. And as you can see, I have knocked down a fair pollock of tree. Now, I should actually be sitting at 30k, but unfortunately, I misjudged the cut on a couple of them, and they actually fell within the, the water trigger. Well, an entire tree is worth just over $2,000 for one of these nice big tallens here. And, uh, well, I'm afraid if you uh, accidentally sell them whole, i.e. untrimmed, they're worth $400. So, yeah, I lost uh, just over $3,000 on uh, accidental drop skis. So, probably less than it cost me to repair the water tower after dropping a tree on it, but... <laughs> that was all supposition I didn't actually have to shell out. So here we go. But that should be enough money to get us uh, get us reasonably into the mowing trade, as it were. Do hope everybody's doing well today. We are now into another week. I'm recording basically two episodes ahead, as I think I might have mentioned at one point. Just in case, you know... There's one of those days when, you know, today my hand is really quite sore with, uh, unfortunately, a bit of the old arthritis, eh? And, uh, yeah, it, it gets a little hard to do things sometimes. So just in case I have a day where it becomes a bit on the overwhelming side, rather than uh, rip y'all off for a uh, portion of your daily happy, happy, joy, joy, I figured I'd just uh, have a one-day backlog of three videos so that if worst came to worst and push came to shove and heave came to hoe and, well, you know, all of that stuff. Although, why any, never mind, I'm not even going to go there. Um, they'll still have content. All I have to do is click a couple of buttons and upload it. So, um, yes, we're going to, unfortunately, for the princely sum of $617, sell that. Thank you. All right. I would, however, like to get a couple of things for the Kramer. We're going to get her to pallet fork. And now that was under front loaders, I believe. The, no. What does the Kramer? Yeah, the Kramer comes under front loaders. Yes, it does. Okay. So, we want for you pallet fork on the bucket. The universal bucket, yes. It doesn't hold much. But, yeah. That's definitely the beastie of choice. How come it's in a different... What's this one? 1860. Oh, I see. This is a fill trigger tool. 1400. So no difference. Might as well get the fill trigger that way if we find ourselves in a spot where we require it. We will have it. No, I'm not going to. That costs too much money. We're just going to go with the basic color. Yes, please. Okay. And as I say, let's also buy ourselves a fork de palette. Yes. Okay. All right. So in mowers, we do have some 
interesting selections. Um, I'd really like to go with this guy, but we're looking at about 15k in total. I suppose we don't really need the trailer. We could drive it around with just this. So, still though, I mean, yeah, it's uh, $14,000. We could go with something like this, but I think it's considerably overpriced for what it is. This cutter will do 5.1 meters. Okay, this guy does two, this guy does two. So, hmm. Now, as well as this, of course, we're also going to need a tether and a baler. So let's say 15K there, a tether is going to run us 2500 so 17 let's call it 18 und baler is going to be nine Ooh. so yeah we're still a little shy of having everything and i'd really like to have everything because otherwise we can end up with some real issues here um, i.e. if we get rain in between one of these processes and soak all the grass, we sort of have to start over. Uh, yeah, I guess the hassles of early spring mowing. So I think what we're going to have to do is do our first cut with this guy. Sure, let's try that. Um, and that will allow us to uh, get our tether. And it will allow us to get this. Okay, so as you can see, we're back down to a visitation of mere peanuts in money. So, okie dokie, let's uh, grab a bit of our kit and see what we've got. I think we're about to get that rain that's been threatening here all day. That's just lovely, isn't it? Da -da 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 -da. Oh, the other thing that we need. Now that I think about it, and before I spend my money foolishly on something else yet again, without remembering this particular beastie, is... where would they hide those? Perhaps here. Yes. I don't already have one, do I? No. Okay, good. I didn't buy it. Yes. I will buy it now then. Thank you. All right. There we go. We do need that for uh, our cornfield. And here it comes. The rain has started. Lovely. Absolutely lovely. Do -do -do -do. That weird little icon down in the bottom right hand corner, that will take you to uh, subscriptions. If you haven't already subscribed and you like the content, you might want to consider doing that. The uh, exclamation point in the top right corner will take you to my Patreon page if you care to support me that way. Now, uh, I don't think <laughs> we're going to be cutting grass today, guys. Uh, if I remember rightly, that is not uh, 
not something you particularly want to do when it's, well, rah, rah, sis, boom, ba. Yeah, one of those days. So, we are supposed to be getting two or three of these days next week here on the West Coast. Something we could really use because uh, it has been a long, dry summer as it has been for many in this part of the world. Now, luckily enough, we did one more time manage to uh, not burst into flame and burn the entire town down this summer. Although, uh, I'll tell you, the way trends go... 15? Are you serious? That's all that was in there? Oh, okay, I did miss it. Good. <laughs> I was seriously wondering about that. I'm not, I'm just going to have a look here because I'm not sure with this thing. Okay, zero is perfectly flat, eh? So maybe about a minus two. And we want the tension off it, so... Minus four at uh, four meters. Okay, so if we go four and four, how does that work out? There we go, I'm pretty sure that got all of it. Of course, I've got a whole happy heap of stump munching again to do here, but I managed not to uh, break anything, at least nothing that I noticed, although it's really a shame to uh, lose so much profit down into the, uh, the great beyond there. How are we doing? Oh, we're 99%. We're just not going to get any better than that anyway, are we? Alrighty, well, that wasn't bad. How are we doing for? You know, that might fetch us some money. We should see what those boards are worth. I'll bet you that'd be a happy joy joy, that one. I still want to know what those guys are singing inside. I'm sure you guys have heard that. You've got to have been near one of these sawmills. Oh, we've got uh, two stacks of boards complete. Let's, uh, since it is, after all, just a really crudsky kind of day. Great demand for what? I've never seen it go by that quick. Darn. I picked the wrong time to uh, hit the button that time. Well, there's a great demand for something somewhere, which is fine because we don't have a whole lot of nothing unless it was a great demand for boards. And if that's the case, well, i got news for you. We're about to do that anyways. So we can only hope that's what it was. I'm going to go down, I'm going to grab our forks de palette, as the French Canadians would not say, and uh, we'll go from there. Hopefully this little, uh, little blue duck of mine is going to actually be capable of picking up such a mighty stack of lumber. Da -da -da -da. Ah. I thought I'd be cutting that meadow today, but we'll uh, let old mommy nature give it a sip of water before we end its little green life, shall we? All right, pallet forks, pallet forks, where have you been? Mm-hmm. 
Mm -hmm. Zip right through the middle. He -he. <clears throat> 409, we've only got uh, ooh, another couple hours of daylight here. And that's a good thing. Come morning, what I want to do is uh, run the weeder over our soon-to-be cornfield so that we have the third layer of fertilization. Yeah, those are fancy window wiper on that thing. Look at that. It's actually a window wiper built onto a window wiper. That's just weird. Why wouldn't they have made that one? Oh, I guess because there is such a uh, such a curve to this windshield. Huh. I don't know that that would work, but <laughs> it certainly looks good. I'm sure it does. It's probably very close to what's really used, but... Huh. Now it just makes me wish I could turn up. Nah, it was just too much to hope for. <laughs> I wanted to turn it on and see it work. But I suppose since we don't actually even get raindrops hitting the windshield... That's kind of weird, isn't it? I mean, it's nice that we don't get rain in the cab, but... Well, most parts. Um, it would be awfully nice, though, if it actually, you know, blurried up the windshield so that we had wipers we needed to use. You know, Euro Truck does it, ATS does it, although it never rains in ATS. But you can turn your window wipers off and get rid of all the dead bugs. Alright, here we go. <laughs> I don't know what you're saying, but I thought I'd sing along. All right. Uh, yeah. And that's why I don't like those. <laughs> a lot of weight. Whoa. Alrighty. Gentle does it. Oh, really gentle does it. Come on. This is not where we sell boards. All right. So, with that said, <laughs> where do we sell boards? Um, I have no idea what I'm doing, do I? Why would I press that when I mean to press this? All right, here we go. Boards, 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 boards. Uh-oh. Uh -huh. All right, now, okay, seems to me then, if I look back, Valley Road Sawmill, which is that place. Hmm, so, Valley Road Sawmill, ooh, right there, which is where we are. Oh, and there they're currently got the great demand to <laughs> believe it or not. Huh. But that isn't where, so... Um... Hmm. Ah, alrighty. It has been a while 
since uh, Watts Farm has been graced with my presence. Why do you look like you want to fall over on your face? Please don't. Okay, good. Gently. Gently. Easy. Nah. There we go. It's not too bad going forward, although you really don't want to get too much centripetal force going on. But going backwards, it does want to uh, tend to allow the laws of momentum to kick in and simply remain where it is while everything else runs away from it. All right, let's hope this is worth just a ton of moony. And the money goes up, and the money goes up, and the money goes up, and up, and up. Hey, Still another layer. Good man. Another one? Oh, yeah. Oh, giggity, giggity. Boom. <laughs> oh, 7K. Hey, that's, uh, that's a buck or two. Nice. Nice. That'll keep you shopping at the dollar store for a month. Alrighty. Well, that's nice to see. That is really nice to see. I don't feel like I'm going to uh, fall over from conceptual brokenness here. Excellent. Well, let's get out here in the rain and have a look at just what is going on. How are we doing? Oh, we still got lots of logs. That's a nice thing. And it shall run for a while. It's only 2,000 liters, but that'll get us another stack of boards. Very nice. Very freaking nice indeed. So yeah, we've still got uh, a heck of a mess to clean up down here. And why have you still got your lights on? Huh? I sure hope your battery ain't dead. Oh, you just needed me to get in and turn them off. Okie donkey dicky duck. Smile for the camera, boys. We're going to rethink that a little bit. Yes, we are. <laughs> yeah. There we are. Let's take the weight off the hydraulics. Excellent. So, I guess my choice is... Yeah. I'll, uh... I'll do that thrilling little bit of work in a bit, shall I? For the moment, let's, um... Oh, am I still watering trees? Ew. I don't want to water trees. Ick. Let's, uh... <laughs> it's too much like work, man. Now there's a windshield wiper. You know that that's going to be inadequate as heck. <laughs> exactly what you're expecting. Ah, oh, the rain. If only you would wash my windshield clean. <laughs> job I could do in the rain, which would be the leader, I wasn't going to be ready to do until tomorrow morning. So, 
I'm pretty sure, isn't that just a... Uh, an old cultivator model? I'm not sure that possibly a Massey. Maybe even in the Massey pack. But I mean, it's by a belt, so I'm good. Lots of kit by them in the packs. Um, hmm. All right. All right. For whatever reason, it's a later the day gets the brighter it seems to be getting. I don't know if that's quite right, but hey, we're gonna go with it. Thing looks like it weighs all the six pounds. I'm surprised that it's uh, struggling with it. But must have a fair weight. Must indeed. Put out the door and give a little push here. Come on. Think again. Think again. Think again. Yes, stupid tractor. There you are. Oh, oh. Yes, indeed. Strong like ox, smart like tractor. Nothing wrong. Oh. Alrighty. Fine. You'd think the fact it was hammering down rain would entirely negate my need to do this. However, <laughs> rules is rules, I guess. Alrighty, here we go. It should be easy enough to tell those that have from those that have not, simply by whether or not they actually have fruit yet. So... That should be Ra Ra Sis Boomba. It is indeed. Half the trailer to you, sir. How the heck did I get three of them done over there? Oh no, there is only two. Okay, never mind. I know. I probably shouldn't have issues distinguishing between two and three at my age, but come on. It's been years since I watched Sesame Street. A person forgets things. La, 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 like, not to drive straight up the face of mountains, for instance. You'd think that would just be a natural, but no, you can forget not to do things like that. Am I going to get out of here? Oh, yes. Oh, no, yeah. Okay. I'm <laughs> lost. <laughs> There's got to be a way out. There we are. Couldn't see the forest from the trees. Well, I guess, so that I don't uh, take the chance of thrilling any of you to the degree where you require perhaps hospitalization, I should uh, end the episode here pretty quick. I will get the rest of these fruit trees watered, and uh, hopefully that will burn off most of the day, as I wouldn't mind getting on to a fresh new day. There you are. Fill her up, Bobby Bill. 
So, with that, I do hope everyone enjoyed the uh, episode. Didn't get too darn wet. Here, we'll get in out of the rain. <laughs> of course, I'm kidding. It rains indoors, too. But, uh, yeah. That, that, that would have been exciting. It really would have. You know, if they could have uh, stopped the rain. <laughs> there you go, guys. Until the next time we meet, do take care of each other. And, uh, well, ciao for now.